fans. The Beach Girl, always a favorite with the crowd. Her opponent, however, is anything but a favorite. High Glow fans, Motormouth Mike Morgan, the moves and maneuvers manual in the broadcast booth for this grudge match. These two have met before, and today's encounter promises to be explosive. The referee trying to get that spear away from Headhunter, but he's dumped in the process. He manages to work Mana over to Aunt Kitty, who takes control of the weapon. And the doll strikes first with a big drop kick. She smashes her with a forearm, trying to stay on top of her, but Mana's power takes over. A test of strength here. Mana's powering her down, but the doll battles back, back and forth. Until Mana ends it with a knee, she sends her into the ropes and goes after her neck. The last time these two met, Mana went after the doll's neck from the beginning, and it seems the leopard hasn't changed her spots. Choking with that tight grip, the referee forces the break. The girl from Malibu, trying to get her breath back. The head on his right arm. Oh, she catches her in a fireman's carry. Showing her off like a hunter's prey. Berserk animal she is. Oh, 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 look at that. She plants that foot against her throat. Again, concentrating the attack on her neck. She wants to add that blonde head to a collection. She breaks at the count, but has a few choice growls for the official. The head on her moves in, but the beach girl hauls her over. Both wrestlers are down. But Mana springs up and kicks her right in the happy face. Headhunter runs to Aunt Kitty, demanding a spear. She wants to finish her off for good. The girl from Malibu takes her down with a rolling tackle. She's not giving up her head that easily. Oh, a shot to the kidney stunts, Mama. The doll's got a win back and adrenaline flowing. She whips her into the ropes and flips her over with a patented Malibu punch. She grabs her by the hair and sets her up for a big beer. The Californian is giving the headhunter a civilized beating. She pushes her back. They size each other up and she sends Mana into the ropes again. Doll's going for a fireman's carry, but the headhunter doesn't want to go for the ride. But the beach girl wins out in this struggle and now she's got Mana hunting for a way out of this hole. Despite her fun-loving appearance, this girl is a strong and tough grappler who can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the best of them, and Mana finds that out the hard way. The mat is no substitute for the soft island ground she is used to. The doll attempting to throw her into the ropes again, as she's done so effectively so far, but the headhunter reverses it. She catches her, use her own momentum against her to throw her over the ropes, and out of the ring! The California doll struggling to get back to her feet and get her barriers. And Mana's fighting Aunt Kitty for that spear. She didn't like that beating she took and she wants to settle things tribal warfare style. She's got the spear and she lashes it on the beach girl's leg. What a wicked blow. She's got her by the hair, waving that spear over her head, menacingly. And she brings it down across her throat. The referee calls for the bell. And it's about time. This one needs to go back to the jungle. you've been drinking too much. What makes you say that? Your liver just burped. <laughs> I heard the headhunter was sent back from Ripley's. That's right. They didn't believe it. 